and welcome back to Flytastic Art. This week we are going to do some insects. We thought it was a bit too early for Christmas. Well, my mum did. I didn't. I wanted to do a Christmas house, but she said no, it's too early. Okay, now let's get started. So we are going to start with the really easy caterpillar and then we are going to put these guides on the Facebook page. Let's get started. Okay, so first, step one, you will draw a circle. And then, a small circle inside it, two small circles. And then, down here, you're doing an even smaller circle. And, and then, same here. Mine's, mine looks like it's looking down at the ground. <laughs> and now it's a big smile. And the second, and step two, draws the antenna. Line, line, circle, circle. Okay, and step three. Draw the body, so that would be one, two, three, four of circles. One, two, three, four. Now, I've done four, but you can put as many as you want. And then we'll put a little tail here. Step four, the feet. So it's going to be two legs coming out of each circle. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then it looks like there's little circles attached to them. So one circle, two circle, three circle, four circle, five circle, six circle, seven circle, eight circle. And there is our caterpillar and body. And now we are going to colour it in. So, for you, I'm going to colour mine in green. But you can colour yours in whatever colour you want. Okay. I think I'm going to do a few different shades of green in, in a bit of body. So one, so one on the body will be this shade of green, like this, a light green. And then the tail will be the light green too. And then I'm going to get another shade of green. And do it here. Mine looks like it's been through some swampy waters in this body. So I'm trying to mix some shades. See what they look like. Okay. So that body's light green, dark green, light green. And then this one's going to be dark green again. So we'll colour it in. When we're finished, when, um, again, you can colour, you can colour yours in in whatever colours you want but I've gone with green okay and now we'll get our other side of green again and do this body colour it in here when you're doing the, the then the corners, try not to go, try not to go out the line. Then go into the other boxes, and um, okay. And then we'll get the screen and close this area in. Try not to go into the eyes or mouth. I'm trying. I'm trying my hardest not to go on the brown. finished caterpillar okay and now for what other insect okay and this one is a dragonfly and this is five easy steps step one start in the middle 
because the wings are going to come out in the last step. Do a circle and then quite wound ones, quite wound eyes quite close together and then antenna coming out. Try and make the antenna the same length. And then make the body quite long, but not too long. Kind of like a sausage shape. Okay, and there's a sausage shape body. And then step four, the lines. One line, two, three, four, about five lines. Okay, step five, the wings come out of the head quite long and quite thin try not to make them kind of try not to make them too thick two wings on both sides try and make them the same length and then two more wings here again try and make the wings the same length as each other And there is our dragonfly. Going to colour it in. You, remember, you can always pause it if we're too fast. Okay, so I'm going to do the body green. Again, you can use whatever colours you want. And then the wings are going to be blue. Dragonflies always live, live in, in lakes. That's why I'm doing it blue. Like so, like some of the lake has rubbed off on the wings, making the making the wings blue. Okay, and that's one part of the wings done. And now for the other set, and now for the other wings. Again, you can always pause if we're too fast. And then get the green out again. And do the, ha the head. There is our dragonfly. Okay, first we'll start with doing a small T. Not too small though. Step two, we will do, we have to do a triangle and then bring these out into the pointy bits. Step three, do the bit at the top. Right now you should have like this shape. Okay. And then step four, the antenna and the legs. Okay, step four, do the antenna and the legs. Cut, bring the line out here and colour these in. Try and make the circles and, and on the antenna bits and the same size. Six, six legs and on insects and the same here three legs on one side three on the other and the last leg okay step five the eyes and the circles a big circle and then a small circle. A big circle and then a small circle. And then the little dots. Try and space the dots out. I'm just doing three on each side. Okay, 
And now for the colouring in. Literally, the only colour you need is red to do that. And there is our ladybird. We're going to put these seats up on the Floatastic Art Facebook page so you can copy them easily. Thank you for watching this episode of Floatastic Art. We, are, we have a really special Christmas surprise for you next week. See you next time for Floatastic Art. Bye!